Rail traffic has been dramatically picking up on the Union Pacific, so this makes more work for all the engines. They generally don't mind work, as it's what they are built for. But there's one thing they do mind. Freight traffic may have increased, but if passenger trains have the right of way. This means whenever needed, freight trains must stop so that passenger trains can take overtake them. This annoyed other Union Pacific engines, especially Jordan and EMD SD60. One morning, Jordan was impatiently waiting to depart Salt Lake City with his freight train. He's all ready to go, but he has to wait for Gumpy to arrive. Hurry up, golden boy. Can't you see that I'm a busy engine too? Finally! Yep, just around the corner was Homeboy. He was running late with the passenger train, the California Zephyr. He was running late. He was doing whatever he could. About time you arrived. What took you so long? Sorry about that. There were unsubmitted trains on the main line. Oh yeah, and I thought you had the right of way. Yes, but some of them took a while to get into the siding. Oh yeah, that's like the best excuse ever. Blame it on them, they didn't move quickly enough. Well now I'm late thanks to that. I know, I'm sorry. I'll never try to not let this happen again. Yeah, you better not. Now hurry up and get to the station so that you won't waste any more time than you already have. And that, he proceeded into the station. At last, let's get moving. After Gomai cleared Jordan's path, he hurried to Tidewater. Jordan arrived, Nicholas was waiting for Jordan so he could get going. I'm getting tired of always getting stopped by passenger trains. It's really making me late. This is one reason I would rather work for CSX. They won't take the scrap. Yeah, I know what you mean. I can stop by past the trees almost every day, and it really drives me bananas. That's messed up. Lilim and Golden Boy must think they're so cool, but really they're both stupid. Our job is just as important as theirs. Well, come to think of it, I think there's some kind of reason for it. All clear, let's go.
Now let's just see if I can make it back without having to worry about other trains. Meanwhile, Nicholas was making good time back at Salt Lake City. Until he got stopped off by a sighting. Aw, oh, what? Are you kidding me? Not even that far from the yard. Great. Here comes Lilium. So I'm only a few miles from the yard, and they've already stopped me here just to let Lilium and her passenger train overtake me. Oh, how nice. Streamliners actually go fast, but Lilium is going pretty fast, though, just to pass Nicholas. Look who has the right of way now. See you at the sheds.